Thanks for joining us live at 5. I'm Dave Corbassier. And I'm Trisha Keen. Police have arrested a young man they say randomly shot and killed two strangers. Tonight, Metro detectives revealing how the 18-year-old stalked his victims and what it took to eventually arrest him. And reporter Sean Delancey is live at Metro headquarters where officers just wrapped up a press conference. Sean. Yeah, Trisha and Dave, police here at Metro headquarters say that they activated their major crimes protocols when shooting ties began twice. to emerge in a rash of shootings near Tropicana and Boulder Highway, giving them extra resources to track down a killer. Police say that the first homicide happened on May 4th, the second last Thursday. Both homicides and a third shooting appeared to involve a man with a similar description using a similar weapon, stalking strangers and then gunning them down. Metro homicide Captain Dory Corrin says that they mobilized multiple departments and flooded the area with police, which led officers to identify and locate 18 year old Alonzo Brown, who led officers on a foot chase before being caught. Corrin says that this kind of effort should send a message to others who could potentially cause violence in town. There's no such thing as getting away with murder in Las Vegas. The fact of the matter is we have the best homicide unit in the country, if not the world. Our homicide clearance rate, which is our ability to solve homicides that occur, is at 95%. Uh, Captain Corrin says that Brown had two handguns on him when he was arrested, and detectives believe that one of them is the murder weapon. Now, Brown is uh, was arrested and has been booked on both charges of open murder and illegal concealed carry charges. At Metro headquarters, I'm Sean Delancey.